Hello, my name is Tim Strickland and I'm your host for Onslow Stories. Today we get to hear from Rodney Walker, who came all the way from Louisiana to have surgery here at Onslow Memorial Hospital. I'm Rodney Walker and I live in Atlanta, Louisiana. My wife and I came to Jacksonville, North Carolina uh, back in December to visit our children for the Christmas holiday. And uh, we've been here about a week and uh, at the end of our stay, uh, I got up uh, the morning we were going to return to Louisiana and uh, with, with uh, stomach problems and stayed on the couch for the first day pretty much. And the next morning, uh, it was hurting so bad we decided to go to the ER. And um, so we went to the ER and uh, found out, discovered that I had uh, diverticulitis and uh, that I had a perforated bowel and uh, so I had to be admitted to the hospital then. During my husband's illness, it was a very uncertain um, time because he was so very, very sick. And there are you know, people that have this same condition that do not make it, so that's always in the back of your mind. But the nurses and Dr. Westbrook were always very comforting and encouraging. After it was determined I was going to need surgery, they were going to have to take out part of my colon and I would be fitted with a colostomy and I'd have to wear that for six months in return to have it reversed. Uh, we were here for the holidays and so I was on break actually um, fixing to go into my last semester of nursing school. And um, while my husband was sick, uh, we had hoped that he would get well enough that we could go back home in time for me to start the semester. But he had several complications and was not able to leave and we had the difficult decision of whether I would stay here with him or go home and start the semester and him be dis discharged hopefully a few days later. Uh, we discussed this with Dr. Westbrook at length and um, I told him that I wanted to be kept in the loop every day um, even though I wasn't able to be here and he assured me that that would be no problem. So. On a daily basis, he would call me and uh, inform me of Rodney's progress and let me know what, what his thoughts were and we would discuss uh, my husband's care. That was probably the most difficult thing I've ever had to do was to leave him and, in such a situation. But the care and concern of the nursing staff and Dr. Westbrook helped me to be able to do that and to go ahead and finish mine. Uh, schooling. Well, my wife and I decided to return to Jacksonville to have the reversal surgery done uh, after uh, we had, you know, the uh, care that we had received from Dr. Westbrook. Uh, we had spoke with, talked with the nurses and, and all the nurses gave him good reviews and of course while we were here for the initial surgery, uh, he took the time to explain to us where we were at um, and, uh, you know, he was familiar with our case. Uh, and this was something that he specialized in. And with that, you know, we felt very confident that when we returned that uh, him being familiar with our case, that, that uh, we, we felt confident that he would do a good job for us. Uh, I can't say enough good things about Onslow Memorial in all aspects. Um, from dietary coming up to speak with my husband about what foods he didn't want on his tray to the clean staff that are constantly on the floor cleaning and making things presentable to the wonderful nurses who were there. Um, there. There is just a wonderful facility and if you have to be sick, it would be the place to be to get well and to be in a caring atmosphere. I would like to thank also Dr. Westbrook for his professionalism and uh, for his uh, very personal demeanor. He uh, took a personal interest in our case and as well as in our in our lives. I mean, he, he asked about things in our family, not just about my, my situation, but uh, you know, he took a personal interest in us as an individual. And uh, I wanted to make sure to, uh, to share that with everyone that uh, he uh, impressed me on a personal level as well as on a professional level. <laughs>